I'm out getting a fit. My mom left them for now. It's really added up. If you haven't seen part one of this video, make sure you go watch it because you'll be awfully confused as to, no you won't because it's literally just a closet clean out. But anyways, I did my closet with my, most of my clothes. Now I'm just going to do the one that has like a whole bunch of junk in it and we're going to see how this goes. But first I need to take like all my stuff from my dorm out and I say dorm like that because I'm living off campus but like I just need to get all this out. So one second I'll be back. Okay, so don't judge because this closet is really like messy because I really don't use it and that's why the rack in my other closet is like on the verge of breaking. But this is what I have to tackle alone because my mother will not help me. And yeah, that's that on that. I just throw everything in here and now it's really added up. And half of this is hers, so I don't know why she won't help me, but that's cute. Fun and festive. Um I definitely broke this rack like a long time ago. So everything's like on the ground. Like we just have a lot to do. This is the situation with all my stuff that like I'm taking for my room and like my school supplies. It doesn't look like a lot, but I have like a lot stuffed in here. There's a whole bunch in that bag. And just the majority of everything that's going to like stress me out is my clothes. But I need to bring all of this downstairs to get it out of there so that the day I actually do move in in like a few days, it'll basically already be downstairs for me because I'm not putting it back in that closet. Okay, so I went through like the stuff on the ground on that side. I don't know what to do with it because my mom just is ridiculous. But I need to go through that bottom shelf. And, um, I have this on the tripod if you're wondering why it's being so like chaotic. And now I need to do this side, which is just like not closed. It's like a whole bunch of junk. So we're gonna do that. See, like, what do you do when you find two of the same shoe, but like it's because you bought so many of the same exact shoe because you always ruin them or get them dirty? Like, what do you do? with them and like this is from when I was like I don't even know like 10. I think I'm going to take this to pack my shoes because like I just need a fat bag to throw them all in. I feel like the storage I meant this closet is lucky just like a storage bin for me and my mom and like everyone because everybody puts their stuff in there. Dude. Because I have so much more stuff to do on my own like packing actual clothes I'm going to let my mom like actually clean this out one day because she's not helping me anyway so good luck Charles this is where like my real anxiety is hitting because these are all my clean clothes like I know they're on the ground y'all some of y'all probably think that's nasty and some of y'all probably do it but like they're just on the ground because I didn't feel like putting them in drawers and I'm about to pack them so I have to go through all of that I'm gonna go through that off camera because it is a lot and then I'm gonna pack like fold it up and then tomorrow when I get the boxes I'm gonna put it in boxes and then I'm gonna put my shoes in this bag right here and then that's just you know the bag I'm taking but I think I'm gonna put toiletries in it to pack because since I'm bringing it anyways I might as well utilize it um so yeah that's what I'm gonna do and then tomorrow when I get the boxes I'm gonna put everything that needs to go in boxes and boxes and try to like uh put the clothes on in trash bags I could probably do that today but I need to go through and see which ones I'm gonna bring so I'm gonna do that off camera because I know it's gonna take a long time but I will show you what I'm watching Liv's life but this like bag is hard on the bottom and it's kind of like square so I'm just going to pack them in here and yeah I'm not going to show like each individual shoe but I will show some of them or maybe I will probably not though because they're just like no point well I mean this is a pack with me but still okay so I've got some new balances in here and then I've got my people call this my Jesus sandals I've got some more sandals and then I've got some house shoes so far and um yeah okay so i have all my shoes in here i have like swim shoes casual shoes like dress shoes pretty much everything is in here and some house shoes so that is it for day one of doing this we'll see what happens on day two so this is the deal with my room today i put up in this box stuff that goes in drawers but i still need to put this up ignore my toes 
Um, and then I have my bikinis in this bag. I still have to go through this, but I've been going through my closet and hanging up stuff. So this is what my bed is looking like. I have 19 hangers in here, I think. And I'll have clothes on them. And then I'm going to continue to fill my trash bags. I'm trying to only bring like short sleeve clothes right now because I didn't realize how much I had. And I know it's not going to all fit. So I'm just going through stuff and seeing what I'm bringing. And I'm about to go get a box. So we're going to go there and then we're going to come back home. My car is literally on E. Why does my camera look like that? The heck? Um, oh, it's because my exposure is up, but my car is literally on E and I'm about to put $5 in because I want my mom to fill it before I go to college. We got this box and then my Dunkin' coupons. And we got this box too, so we are going to make it work. I'm about to go inside. This so box is full with like drawer clothes. It has socks and pajamas and like underwear, I think. Yeah, underwear and bras, like, but not all of them. So. so I'm going to start filling this one while I already have. Like this is my bikinis right here. This is a Bluetooth speaker that I never opened. It's still brand new. And then this is some more like drawer clothes. And then I need to put some more bras and some more underwear in here. And then I need to finish going through and trash bagging my clothes. And then I need to go through all of this still because I have been putting this off for the longest because it just looks really chaotic, but I'm gonna do it. So that's what we're doing now. So I've got some jean jackets because I obviously want to take my jean jackets. And then like nicer shirts, I guess, that aren't just t-shirts, like stuff like this. And then I need to get the one that's out of the room in the laundry room. Get this one right here. And add that to that stack. I guess I can just leave that on. I mean, I don't really care. Okay, and then in the dryer, I have like some underwear and bras and bikinis. And I need to get that out too because I did a small little laundry. Yeah, I know my room is looking still a mess, but there's nothing I can really do about that right now just because like of this whole situation. So I'm going to use this bag to pack my electronics such as both my laptops and um, the camera. Well, I'm going to be vlogging that day, so it's probably not going to be in here. But I'm just going to put my laptops in here and like put some cushion in there to make sure that they're secure and protected. So I'm going to go ahead and add this to the box. But in this box, we have a whole bunch of random things that I just couldn't fit on the hangers or like... Um, I didn't have jean hangers for these at the time. I couldn't find them. I found two But I hang some of my jeans up on normal hangers anyways, like just fold them over so I have Bikinis under there some jeans right here the belt and the belt hook hanger right here a bag just in case you know I need it and then I have two purses a fanny pack lounge pants and lounge shirts and then some socks and some underwear over there because I couldn't fit them in the other small box I'm also gonna add well, I'll just go ahead and do it right now I'm gonna add these two, like one's a dress and then one's a romper, so I'm adding that in there. And until I pack up my electronics, I'm just, I'm just gonna put this back. This box isn't done, ignore how dirty my floor is, but I'm gonna put like all my organizational hangers. I have a ton, I never really realized how many I have, but I'm gonna put them all in that box. And um, the day of, I'm gonna see how many I need to use and then send the rest back with my mom and she can put them back in my closet or she can use them. So I'm just bringing them just in case because I, my closet where I'm staying is actually bigger than this one right here. Not that one obviously, but it's like you can walk in it more and it's a little bit deeper than that one. So I should have no problem fitting all my clothes if they all fit in there before, you know. So we'll see, but um, my bed, not the one here, the one at the place I'm staying at has um, drawers under it, but it only has four. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm gonna use this box right here to put toiletries and like makeup and stuff like that in. But I'm not gonna pack that until Thursday night just because I'm gonna need it. So I'm not gonna include that in this video. But I'm pretty much done packing clothes. The only thing I need to pack is like, you know, the toiletries and stuff like that. And then um, my electronics. And then I will be done because I have my clothes and like stuff for the place packed. And then the day of, I need to, or the day before, I don't really, it doesn't matter to me. I need to run to the store and get like a few things such as um, toilet paper and like a plunger and stuff that I forgot. And this is just a basket full of hangers and like random stuff that I don't know what to do with. Right here I have 
one trash bag full of clothes and I know that that's like a lot of plastic that I'm using but I just didn't know another way to efficiently pack it and then my exposure's up so everything looks really bright but I have a bag of shoes, my stuff in my room in the bathroom and then a bag of, um, I meant not a bag, a box of just like drawer clothes and like underwear and stuff like that. Okay, so now I'm in my mom's room. I have, oh, I love these. I have this um, hanger of jeans, and I don't know how to like pack this because if I put this in the bag, it's just gonna be like really weird. So I'm just leaving this one out. And then I have um, one, two, and three bags of clothes. And I'm gonna come back for like my more wintry stuff after you know it's that season. This is what my closet looks like. This is what the shoe situation looks like. I still have to pack those shoes that are downstairs, but I'm gonna wait to pack that just because, I mean, if they're downstairs, I wear them a lot. Um, up here, I still need to go through that. I don't know why I didn't do that, I think I forgot, but yeah, I just need to go through that. And then, it's pretty empty in here. I mean, not really, but compared to how it usually is, it's empty. Okay, I look literally scary. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. And stay tuned because my move-in vlog will be up either the end of this week or the beginning of next week. It just depends on how much time I have this weekend. But stay tuned because there will be much more college content coming soon.